Welcome to How to Play Chess Part 1. And in this video, I'm going to discuss the, the objectives of the game, the initial setup of the board, and how to move pieces, and how to capture pieces. Um, so, and um, this is a revision to my original Part 1, because I didn't, don't think I discussed how to move pawns and how to capture with pawns. So anyway, uh, I think we'll get started here. Um, the objectives of chess is to checkmate the opposing king. Um, so um, I will discuss how to check and check and checkmate in uh, the second part of this video. But first, uh, chess is played on a chessboard. Um, this is a square board divided uh, into uh, eight by eight, sixty-four. Uh, grid of 64 squares alternating between light and dark or dark and light if you will um, so there's 16 pieces on each side there's a there's a, um, uh, black pieces and white pieces um, so the 16 pieces consist of 8 pawns and 8 non-pawns the 8 non-pawns are the king and queen two bishops, two knights, and two rooks. And basically eight eight pawns. Um, so that's six, eight, and eight, eight, non, eight pawns and eight non-pawns for a total of 16 pieces. Um, blacks, uh, basically they also have um, king and queen, uh, two bishops, two knights, and two rooks, and eight pawns. 16. So you can see the symmetry on this. Basically, it's symmetrical. The king, the white king is on the dark square. The black king is on the light square. Um, so we get that here. It's, that's the initial setup. Um, so I sh now get to how to move these pieces. Um, so the king can move um, to any any square in any direction, but only one square, uh, provided that he's he's not in check. Um, so it can move. The king can move up or down, left or right, and diagonally, up or left, up or right, lower left, lower right. So it can move to here, 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 here. Um, so it has that that going for it. And again, it, if if it's, it can't move to um, a square where it's in check. Um, the queen, on the other hand, can move um, in any direction, but it, it can move to any square where it's not blocked or where there's not some enemy piece. Um, so it can move to, like the king, it can move to uh, up or down, left or right. It can also move up or left, up or right, lower left, lower right. It can move here, 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 here. But it can also move um, two squares in a two squares in any direction. You can also move three squares in any direction, and where possible, can move four squares in any direction. So it can move to here, 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 here. So the queen has a lot of possible squares you can move to. Um, the knight, uh, no, it's, actually, let's do the bishop here. Um, the bishop, uh, can move, uh, diagonally, um, so it can move, uh, upper, upper left to any square, upper right to any square, um, Lower right to any square, 
lower left tiny square. So you can move here, 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 here. You can move here, 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 here. Um, but it can only move to to uh, if it's this is the it was initially placed on a on a on a, a light square, so it can only move to a light square. It cannot move to a dark square. Um, so you can actually tell what the initial position is because if this is a, uh, this is a bishop moving on a light square, it can, it, can, it had to be placed on a light square to begin with. Um, and a dark square can move to like basically any dark squares diagonally. So the knight, um, it can move uh, to it can move up two squares, and one square to the left, one square to the right. It can also move down two squares, one square to the left, and one square to the right. Um, it can move left two squares, one square up and one square down, or it can move right two squares one square up and one square down um, and so this is interesting because uh, if it can't really be blocked by any pieces because if there's any pieces in in, um, it, in the middle here it can just jump over them um, so that's the moves of a knight um, the Rook, on the other hand, can uh, can move um, up or down, left and right, in any direction. Um, here's it's, if there's no, no opposing, if there's no uh, friendly or enemy enemy pieces, can move um, here, 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 here. here. Um, so basically, it's the it uh, can only move straight in in any direction. Um, so then there's the there's the pawn. So the pawn is a little bit different because it can only move up, uh, but it can, but on the initial move, it can move it can move either one square. Up or two squares up. So here's the the white pawn is at c2. Now is at e2 e2 rather. Um, it can move to either e3 or e4. Um, so if um, so here's there there's a pawn at c6. It can move only to c7. Can also there's also uh, rooks on either side, so it can capture either either uh, either rook. But we'll get to that later on. Um, so I should note the the uh, capturing move. So basically, if there's um, if there's a friendly piece, it will block the uh, the king from moving to any of the, any of these uh, squares, but if there's an enemy piece, it can capture the enemy piece, provided that it doesn't put the king in check. Um, so, yeah, if there's say there's a white bishop here, it will be blocked by the white bishop. If there's a black bishop there, uh, it can capture the black bishop provide that it uh, it doesn't put the king in check um, similarly uh, the the queen uh, if there's a f a friendly piece it will block the queen from moving to that square but if there's an enemy piece it can capture that piece by moving to that square um, so if there's a a a white bishop here will block the the queen from moving to that square, but if there's a black bishop here, you can capture that. Um, so um, let's see. The 
bishop again if there's if there's a friendly piece it will block the the bishop from moving to that square if there's an enemy piece it can capture that piece by moving to that square um the the knight same thing if there's a friendly piece it will block the the knight from moving to that square if there's an enemy piece it can capture that square by moving to that square um and uh let's see the rook same thing if there's an and if, if there's a friendly piece it will it'll block the the rook from move, moving to that square if there's an enemy piece it can capture that piece by moving to that square um the then here's the pawn a little bit different um the pawn can only move forward one square but it can also uh it can also move, it moves diagonally to capture a piece. So here, um, it can move forward uh, to c7. It can also move diagonally to either b7 or d7 to capture either uh, either rook. Here you go. The pawn of c6 can e e take either black rook. Um, so that's it. So anyway, that's it for this video. Um, again, like, comment, subscribe, and if you find this video of some use to you, then consider subscribing to this YouTube channel. The next video will be about check and checkmate, but that's it for this video. I'll see you in the next video.